uh, you work as a data scientist. Uh, can you please tell me uh, uh, which background uh, uh, do you think is the best for uh, for a data scientist? Uh, mathematics, physics, computer science, engineering? Yeah, well, um, I'm. this is a sort of a, a question that I'm interested in myself because mm -hmm. um, my background, I haven't worked with data science in the past, but seeing how sort of important it is for this emerging field and, you know, seeing all of the new results and I found this field very interesting, I, I've been getting into learning data science. Um, I, I think that mostly any sort of STEM background is probably good to get into data science. Mm -hmm. it, it's, uh, I would say the most important sort of skill set um, is just knowing how to sort of interpret data uh, having a basic kind of understanding of statistics mm -hmm. and probability more than whether or not you've done mathematics or physics or computer science or engineering. I think everyone can, um, at least I hope, uh, sort of develop their skills in data science. Mm -hmm. uh, can you please tell me something about your your job? Uh, what are you working on uh, as a data scientist? Yeah, um, I'm working in this uh, new startup called New Health, mm -hmm. which is um, essentially started focused on trying to monitor uh, neurological conditions like Parkinson's disease mm -hmm. and eventually we want to move on to Alzheimer's and dementia. Um, so it's a health tech startup, we're still very very early stage. Mm -hmm. um, my role, I worked with OPDC which is Oxford Parkinson's Disease Centre uh, which is based in the neuroscience department here as a data scientist for the past three to four months. Essentially um, it gave me a chance to get some practical uh, experience in applying simple data science techniques, um, doing sort of the background sort of work, which is very, very important in being able to do mm -hmm. any data science application, such as, you know, cleaning up your data, mm -hmm. um, knowing how to deal with missing data, sort of crucial elements that I didn't have any experience with. Mm -hmm. And now the idea is to try to translate that research into a product that we can um, hopefully uh, give to patients and mm -hmm. clinicians. Um, so I, I, you know, I don't understand the neuroscience very well. I've been picking up some things as I've been working on the job, but really my role is to try to translate this research into, in, into this new product. Right. And